Hi everybody, 860 Cologne here with another fragrance review. This time we're doing Burberry Summer 2013. Now, I am not completely sure how different this one is from the previous uh, Burberry Summers. I believe there was one in 2007 and 2011, I think. The notes that I see on the 2011 one seem very similar to this. I'm not sure if this is a completely new release or not because honestly, I don't remember the Burberry Summer 2011 much at all. Um, but we'll go on. I'm going to assume this is a new fragrance. Hopefully they haven't sold out that much and just repeating the same thing from before. Now, the tagline for this is Burberry Summer is inspired by the great outdoors. Burberry Summer for Men is, an ad is adventurous and energetic. The top notes have yuzu leaves, mandarin, and mint. The heart uh, has a heart of floated wood and gorse flowers. The base notes of cedar wood and sandalwood. Uh, the bottle is a summer duplication of the original Burberry for Men that was launched back in 1995, the typical Burberry bottle, the tall skinny top. Now, off the top, it's vibrant and effervescent. That's really nice. I get a bright lemon that mainly stays in the realm of fragrance, but also has a little toe just crossing the line into like uh, lemon cleaner, but not too much. The lemon vibe lasts for about maybe 15, 20 minutes, then, then slowly fades away or just calms down a bit. And it becomes a, a pleasant, soft fragrance. Now the good, it's fresh. It's summery. It makes you feel lively. And that's a great thing for a summer fragrance to do. The bad, longevity. I keep on saying this. And I know not to expect much from a summer fragrance in terms of longevity and depth and everything. But still, I mean, Burberry Brit from last year, the Burberry Brit Summer, was so nice. I love that fragrance. That was the first fragrance I bought back in 2012. And it had great longevity. It wasn't exactly a... Um, summer fragrance per se. It was basically a reworking of the original Burberry Brit from 2004, I believe. So I liked that one a lot and I thought it was good for year-round use and I'm glad I have a bottle of that one. But this one, not liking too much. But it has some great possibilities. If your skin can get some longevity out of this one, I, I think you'll like it. For me, it's not lasting too long. But when it did last, when it does project off of my skin, I liked it. Wasn't anything groundbreaking, but definitely worth a uh, sh trip to Macy's or wherever you want to go and try to smell this one. This is a limited edition, only comes in the one size, the large, I think they call it a 3.3 or 3.4, 3.4, and it's $62. So there's what I think of Burberry Summer 2013. Let me know what you think. Make some comments below, uh, subscribe to my channel, like this video if you like, and let me know what you think, alright? Take care.